What's been said in the aftermath uh, of the overall defeat? Um, yeah, we've obviously had a, a couple of chats, brief chats. I think we'll probably have a bit more of a discussion today as a group. Before we before training, we generally get together batting group and then a bowling group will sort of split off and, and have a discussion about um, how the game went. But uh, still really positive. I think we to be able to push England um, as far as we did with such a below par total gives us a lot of... Um, a lot of confidence going forward. Um, to know that we probably couldn't have batted much worse, um, and to still sort of push the game to um, giving ourselves a chance near the end. But uh, we know we've just got to make more runs and um, and give our, our bowlers a bit more to bowl at. How do you feel about your own knock at the Oval? You played so well, but surely felt you could have got a much bigger score. Yeah, definitely. I left. I think I left 13 or 14 overs out there of batting, um, which was disappointing. But um, in saying that, I felt like I hit the ball really well. I stuck to my strengths, and um, and yeah, hopefully that that's just a building block for the rest of the, the tournament. Um, but it's, it's as you said, it's a start. It's not um, quite what the team's looking for at the moment. We're looking for big hundreds and um, and match winning scores, and 60s aren't match winning scores. Do you think you need another batsman here, someone like Darcy Short, perhaps? Uh, that's that's not up to me to sort of comment on the team team balance. I, I think. They'll come up in selection meeting, uh, deciding what we what we want for this ground, and um, we've got obviously Sean Marsh, who's been playing over here as well. Um, he can give us some inside information on how the ground's been playing and how the wicket's been playing. So we'll tap into that for sure. England could can take control of this series if they win here and go two 0 up. I mean, what do you need to do to stop them, really? Well, we need to probably beat them to get it one all. <laughs> um, yeah, as I said before, uh, we just got to make more runs and make sure. When we bat first, we've got to make more runs and give our bowlers a bit more to bowl at. And um, if we're chasing, we've just got to be a bit more clinical and probably keep a few more wickets uh, for the back end because uh, over here, uh, with some shorter boundaries, you can you can certainly make make more at the back end and, um, and cash in on those later overs. You're missing so many key players, though. I mean, is it a struggle for you here right now? No, certainly not. I think if you look at the, the squad that we've got um, at the moment, it's very similar to the T20 squad that we had that was extremely successful in that tri-series. Uh, we went through that tournament undefeated with um, pretty much the same um, big guns out and um, to perform as well as we did with that group and, and come over with a very similar group to here. It gives us a lot of confidence coming into this tournament.